So folks, it is 6 p.m. on a Sunday night, and I've decided that in the next, over the course of the next four days, I'm going to finish the last 10,000 words that I need for NaNoWriMo, because I am ready to have this done. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to do it, because, again, it is 6 p.m., and tomorrow in the morning I have to decorate my church for Advent, and then work in the evening. On Tuesday, I have to be to work at 1, which means that I have to be ready for that around 12. And then Wednesday, I don't work, so that's going to be the day that I probably get the most words in. Honestly, I don't care if I have to get up at 5 a.m. and if I have to stay up until midnight. I am going to get these words done. I am ready to have this done. And I know other people have written more in less time. I know people who have finished the entire thing in five days, the last five days. And so I think it is doable. Um, and I'm going to vlog it because miracles happen. <laughs> Six p.m. and I've written over three thousand words for the day, so yay me! Um, and in an attempt to preserve myself from burnout, I'm going to be taking a break for the rest of the night because I also didn't mention that all morning and afternoon I went to church. I got home for a short amount of time, got some words in, and then I went to a birthday party for my grandfather, and then I came home and did more words. So essentially, I've had no downtime at all today. Um, and I'm not going to for the next couple days, and I haven't for the last few days, so I'm trying to keep myself from going through burnout through doing this, because I want to finish it, but I don't want to end up with massive long-term results because I gave myself burnout. So I'm going to take a break for the rest of the night, get some downtime, and pick things back up in the morning before I have to be at my church to do decorating. <laughs> So far I have about a thousand words. And I have about an hour until I gotta get ready to leave for work. So I gotta try to make the most out of that amount of time. And get the most words out of today that I can. This ending is going to be as dramatic as I thought it was. I'm going to cry. So it is now Tuesday, day three of trying to make this happen. And it's looking more and more possible because I wrote at least 3,000 words the last two days and now I only have 5k remaining, which is awesome. Um, and I don't work tomorrow. And my schedule will be a lot less tight. So between today, trying to get as much done as possible, and tomorrow... I will definitely be getting this done, which is really cool. I didn't manage to give an update because I ran out of time, but um, once I finished yesterday, I basically had to go directly to work, and that's pretty much what it's going to be again today because I actually go to work a lot earlier today. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what I got going on right now, and then tomorrow I don't work at all, so I will get to finish it off then. I like how it goes, new. <laughs> So, I now know why my brain feels so dead, because I just wrote almost 3,700 words in, like, four hours. So now I'm pretty brain dead, but I only have about 2,000 words to write tomorrow, and then I'm done. Like, the temptation is real to finish it all off today and just, like, keep pushing myself, but I know I'm gonna hit burnout if I do that. As it is, like, I wrote a lot today, and my brain is pretty tired, so I 
don't need to push myself any further into like burnout. So that's it for today and I'm going to I'm probably gonna watch some YouTube or something, not gonna lie. I haven't had hardly any time to watch YouTube this month because I've been trying so hard to get the words in. So I have a couple more chores to do and then I'm just gonna sit down and try to chill out a little bit before I have to go to work. officially done it is literally only 9 30 but i started at like 7 30 and i was raring to go and i only had two thousands words left and i got like two text messages first thing in the morning from friends who were like you only have so much left you can do it like it was it was the sweetest um so now i'm done and i finished the series <laughs> and granted this draft is really bad and so is the first draft for the last one which is why it needs um editing but I feel kind of sad now like I finished the whole series I'll go into when I first embarked on this I was thinking like trying to do the last 10,000 words in like four days when I had a really full schedule was not going to be happening but it actually worked out really well because I got most of the words done on the busy days and I just had to do the last little bit this morning and I don't feel brain dead or burnt out right now so like I, I feel like I've won at life. Alexa, play a victory tune. Here's Victory Tune by Christopher Madigan on Amazon Music. Mm -hmm. 